Hey guys, this is just a quick tutorial video for anybody who needs this. I just had to figure this out. <clears throat> now I don't have any fancy streaming stuff set up yet. So um, if you need to transfer saves from a stream game onto the hard onto the downloaded system of your PS5 and or you want to play a downloaded version of a game on the PS5 from PS Now and you need the original cloud save, which is what happened to me. <clears throat> so basically I started streaming this Killing Floor 2 game and I was playing it via streaming. I wasn't. I didn't have it downloaded to my system, so I played it during streaming, uh, and then I stopped playing. So it was automatically uploaded to the cloud. Now what happened was, I then downloaded the game, as you can see here, where it says "Play Now." When I loaded that game, it did not have. It did not automatically detect my cloud safe. It wanted me to start from scratch. So if this happens, basically. What you'll need to do is, and you can do this prior to downloading the game if you want to, you will need to basically stream the game. Now, since I've already downloaded it, I will have to play play the stream version. You'll go to this, you'll hit stream. You need to play the streamed version. I, I've just done this a moment ago, and so it'll ask me to override games. So I'll pause this until it loads. All right, so here we are. I got the streamed version loaded. Now, when you start a streamed game, what you'll do is you'll you'll press the PS button on your PS5 remote. That's this one right here. You'll press this to bring up the XMB. When you have the XMB brought up, you'll see this first card on the left. That's your game streaming, right? It'll say your game, your title. Now you're going to press the X button. Now it's going to show right here, manage save data. You're going to press X on that and it is going to close. You're going to say yes. Now you're going to see your save data in PS now. Now you're going to click on it, copy to online storage. You're going to select the game or games you want to copy. Killing floor. Now, I've already just copied this, so it's going to ask me to override because I've just did this before I made the video. If you have a version on the desktop like I did because I had loaded it in order to find this out in the first time, your desktop will already have one also on the physical. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to override that. And that's the step we're going to get to next. So you won't get this screen if you're doing this from step zero. Now that that's done, we'll X out of here and we'll go back. We'll close out of the game. Make sure that's closed. Now that we have that done, you would click on here. You would press, oops. You would press this button right here. It's gonna bring that up. Now you can select upload, download. And this should just take a moment. Now you're gonna see your options. Now if you just started the game for the first time like I did, there will be console storage, which will be not the one that you just copied. It'll look like this. Now again, ignore mine because I did this prior. So you aren't gonna wanna do the console because that will upload a fresh version of nothing because you didn't realize what was happening. Same thing happened, so don't do that. The, the downloaded cloud storage we just brought and downloaded is what you're gonna click on. Then you'll hit download and it will download that and override your console storage. And you're gonna to wanna to say yes to that. And that's it. That's how you get the streamed games from the PS4 streamed games from off the cloud of your PS Now and onto your PS5 so you can play downloaded games. I'll do some more tutorials and games later when I get around to it, guys. I'm just in the process of moving. Hope that helped out some people.